Hi everyone, welcome back. Let's take a look at how we can turn a basic post inside the post tab into an announcement that will not only stand out in the post tab, but will also send a notification of importance to all members of the team. So here I am in my remote learning class team inside the general channel inside the post tab. At the very bottom, I come to the new message text box. Instead of typing my message, I'm going to click on the A icon in order to format this post. Here, where it says new conversation, I'm gonna click this drop down menu and I'm gonna change it from a new conversation to an announcement. Notice the difference right away. You have a space for a headline, a space for a subheading, and then a space where you can type your announcement. Now, before we type our announcement, I want you to notice that you can change the permissions for the announcement. Do you simply want to just post this announcement and the students cannot reply? You would choose you and moderators can reply. Moderators might be a co-teacher that you have in your class team, or you can leave it set to everyone can reply and then students can reply to this announcement. Notice that you can also create the announcement and post in multiple channels. So if you organized your team by adding new channels in addition to the general channel, you could actually type this one announcement and click post in multiple channels and select the other channels you wanted this announcement to be posted to. Let's go ahead and add in an announcement. Now I want you to notice that this headline space here, I can choose a different color or I can choose a catchy illustration to grab students' attention. I've added my subheading and I've given some instructions inside the announcement. In this case, I've directed students to view an attachment to learn more. So just like any other post, we can attach a document by simply clicking the paper clip and notice that I can browse recent files that I've been working on. I can even look for attachments or documents from other teams files libraries. I can browse my OneDrive and because I've connected my Google Drive, I can even browse my Google Drive or I can upload from my computer. So let me just attach a file here. I will click upload a copy. I want it to be uploaded to class materials and I simply click upload file. Once the file uploads to our team, I can then go ahead and finish typing my announcement. Or if I'm ready to post this to the stream, I can come down to the bottom right corner and click the paper airplane icon or the send button. Notice that this post stands out in the stream in the post tab, but see this little red icon here for announcement? This means that students will also get notified that an announcement has been made inside the class team. Notice that that file is nested right inside this particular announcement for all students to view.